life. Life is a disease. A millennium ago, a supreme necromancer was on the verge of conquering the world. But you know what they say about best laid plans. Inevitably, heroes shall emerge. So, I was made dead. Again. But what does death really mean for somebody who has mastered it? Boredom. An eternity to ponder my errors and how close I came to victory. I am a mortal. But when this world ends, even I will know oblivion. And so, I ask myself, will I be given another chance to rise before it happens? Another chance to fulfill my ambition? Ah, it seems that fate has smiled after all. Ah, uh, well, damn. That was actually extremely good, um... Intro. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to Oritis. I think that's how you say it. Lord of the Dead. And as you can see, this cl disclaimer right here, it is a hardcore tactics role like pretty much like the Darkest Dungeon. That is the one reason why I wanted to try this game out, but I found a demo on Itch.io, so that's what I'm going to be playing is the demo. From what I know, the demo is the only thing that's available right now. I don't think it's actually on Steam. It's supposed to be coming to Steam soon, which I'm looking forward to, but I wanted to try the demo and see how it was. Um, I have been wanting to play the full game because the art style actually looks pretty interesting from like the screenshots. So I have high hopes. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay. This game is difficult and your minions will more will likely die. Yep, true. And think they are expendable just because they are already dead. Okay, so you just still use them when they're dead, okay? Hence Lord of Dead. Every fight is a challenge and resources are always limited. Enemies are strong and show no mercy towards their dead opponents or undead opponents. You will need to play smart, adjust your strategies for different encounters and enemy types. In short, prepare to spend several hours mastering the game to, to achieve victory. Bring death to the mortal lands. Uh, this is an, also an alpha, by the way. I really enjoyed the intro for sure. What settings do they have here? Okay, they have show titles, uh, support both of those languages. Cool. New. Oh wow, they have several difficulty levels. Alright, tutorial first. Like always, the developer's name will be at the bottom left. Oh. Yeah, the art style actually looks way better when you look at it. I also joined the community. So like I said, kind of like the Darkest Dungeon. The yellows, little squares are the formations. So this guy is in the second slot. And he can only deal damage to the first two enemies in front. Alright, there are three different types of attack. There is physical, magical, stress. You know, if you play the Darkest Dungeon, you pretty much understand. Stress attacks influence sanity. Yeah, I know too well about that. If it drops to zero, 
the target has a chance to die whenever it is hit with another stress attack. So yeah, it's just pretty much an insta-kill. Blow them to pieces! Death comes in loud. Low level sanities can lead to insanity. A character suffer from insanity will manifest one of several possible negative effects. Enemies can run away from the battle. Oh, you fucking douche. Don't you dare run away from the battle. On the last position. So anybody who's behind or the last member behind you can flee. Okay. If only one remains, his chance of fleeing is increased. Enemies that escape do not leave behind any items or parts. Oh, so you would have to kill them straight away. Note it. If insanity, dro if insanity drops low to zero... Okay, yeah, we already read that. Let's give them a stress attack. Dude, why do I feel like we're playing a dungeon? Is that what we're doing? The, these guys are the adventurers and we're playing the dungeon? I think he was trying to move or run. Let's let's cancel that idea. There we go. So they're just literally attacking each other. Damn. Yeah, I feel like we're just playing. It's like the opposite of Marcus Dungeon. We're playing that. <laughs> we're playing the monsters. That's actually uh, really fun. Nora's armor. Dude, you can only blame your friend. That dude is fucking you, you over. One by one, life oh, he died from the stress. From this world. There we go. Mine is the winning side. Dude, that's. That's dope. I actually like this game so far. Especially the art style. Amazing. New Undeads are available for crafting. Craft this undead minion. Okay. Hold up. Where would I do that? Talk to you. There she is. Ah. Uh, a design from my... Younger years. <laughs> Dude, you don't look that old. Now, form your battle group. Remember, the minions' position and role are more effective in battle. Okay, so basically, Darkest Dungeon rules you gotta put them in the right order or they won't be able to, to actually attack the right way. Like, if the archer's in front, she won't be able to use her skills because she's aiming towards everything that's in the back only. And if she's in the front, she can't do that. Noted. After each battle, restores mana, and any you not Despite currently in battle team restores both. I am a rather impatient necromancer. You'll be fine. Let's go battle with these guys. Oh yeah, see? So she can't really attack any of these guys because she's in front. This is why her, all of her skills are locked. Okay, so I can only switch with you. Oh, whoops. I had to push her.
Alright, now we have him going berserk. Okay, Stance. A special type of ability that some characters can use. When a character enters a stance, they will perform a certain action. When a certain condition is met, as described in the ability itself, a stance lasts until the start of the character's turn. Oh, the character's next turn. A stance can't be cancelled unless it is mentioned in the text of the ability. Okay, so it can only be cancelled if it says it can be cancelled. To cancel a stance, simply target the character with the ability that either forces them to move or stun, blind, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Defensive stance? Fuck your defensive stance, dude. Ah, oh, god, you stabbed me, you piece of shit. Not cool. Oh, we can't use the stress yet. Okay, so let's do... This. You will soon embrace your new existence. Okay, block is automatically used to neutralize a single physical attack. These can be stacked. The attack is successfully notified. The defender loses one of his blocks. Okay. So, blocks magic attacks. And armor can also block physical attack. So he doesn't lose his armor though. I'm gonna need you to stress out. Dude, oh, I just realized how bloody they're getting. Dude, I love that detail. But we are getting fucked up here, so we're gonna have to go big dick damage. Okay, let's go with... Ah, so close. You almost died. Are you gonna attack your teammates or something? No? Got uh, regrets, dude. You should have done that. As worthless as you were in life, you will be worth something in death. Okay, so as I do that, they suffer a lot of damn damage. <laughs> now, let's make sure you don't run. <laughs> Ah, let's use this. Ah, oh, he has blunt. Let's make sure his stress goes off. There we go. Another step towards my eternal kingdom. Dark Knight. It's something we can create now. Oh, you can even upgrade their armors. Okay. Uh, let's see. There's even info here about the character too, like lore. Can't read it though. Oh, just this. There it is. So now he gets increased HP.
I don't think I can take it off of him. I think once it's on you, can't get rid of it. All right, so we just open talents and alchemy. Okay, so this. Oh, no talents to, to learn. But we do have alchemy over here. Learn magic. Use it to turn the tides of battle. I like that one. Return to me. The stress ah, damage could be also something pretty good. Out. Okay, so now can we craft our, our next minion? Yes, we can. Let's see how sick this guy looks. Oh, he actually looks pretty damn cool. Hold up. Alright, so I would personally take you, put you back there, take you, put you right there. You are like pretty damaged too, but I have the heart thing on you. Is there a way to heal you? I guess it was like at the battle, right? So these are the mines. Ooh, a quest. So now I gotta fight these guys. Wait, are they just fighting through all of my minions I have created? So if this team dies, the next one comes up? Get rid of this guy for sure. Distinguish hope. This is Stay what home. thousand years of evolution looks like. Yeah, pathetic. I lose armor though. Okay, thank God. So panic. Lose accuracy, but increase his chance of escape. God damn it. That's not good. That is definitely not good. We need to kill him before he runs off. Dark Knight needs to nerf. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, let's go with accuracy boost because you need it. We need to use that every time. <laughs> nice try. Okay, so he's on fire now. Oh, 
Oh damn. Uh, I didn't see crit on that. The I hate to see plants using it as fertilizer. <laughs> well damn. There's also artifacts. Oh, okay, so if they're outside of battle, they get healed. Okay. Noted. So I would have to switch him out. Okay, I see, I see, I see. Mubby. I see. Ah, uh, dude, I cannot wait for this game to come out. I really want to try it out now. Hopefully they would have, like, way more... Like, because I love a huge variety. <laughs> you know, the, these amount of characters can satisfy me, but I want to see it fold all the way over here, touching this. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think they would want to go that far. But still, this game has been pretty damn awesome. And I definitely recommend trying out the demo. It is... <laughs> oh boy, I didn't expect it to be this damn good. I expected it to be good, but Jesus, I might get addicted to it. And yeah, my minions have already almost died, but you know, you, you can crave some stronger ones, you know? They'll come back way stronger than the rest, baby. Slim chance, because I'm behind the wheel. <laughs> uh, oh, there's a fountain. Ah, oh, damn. I, I should have left him in there. I'm kind of sad that I moved up. Without this. Because I figured it was like some kind of hilly thing. And there's the exit. Very unique. And that's the tutorial. The actual game itself would begin here. But how long would it go? That's the real question. Oh, you get to keep the characters from the tutorial. Ah, neat. You get to keep some things from the tutorial too. What about alchemy? Okay, alchemy you get a refresh on. You still get no um, talent though. You have no artifacts, but you still get to start out with your default units. Cool. With that said guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm gonna put to you playing a little bit more of this into then. Peace out. Where it's gonna get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you got to lose?